Thanks for purchasing the MPX Native Reverb plugin. We're excited that you've chosen the gold standard of digital reverbs to join you on your musical journey. The MPX Native Reverb plugin delivers the legendary lexicon sound through a single polymorphic plugin with seven different reverb types and over 100 of the most versatile and finely crafted studio presets. This is the ultimate home recording and professional studio plugin package for creating professional, inspirational mixes within popular DAWs such as Pro Tools, Logic, Enuendo, or any other AAX, RTAS, Audio Unit, or VST compatible host. Today we're going to show you various features and how to utilize the MPX Native Reverb in your DAW. First start by adding a track into your DAW and insert the MPX plugin as an effect on the track. Today we're going to be using Ableton Live. Once you have your track prepared, you will see the MPX Native Reverb and its graphical interface. To begin, select the category of what reverb type you would like to use. In this example, we'll be using the large plate reverb type. Plate reverbs are among the audio world's most utilized and classic sounds based on a lot of the old reverb plates in studios from the 1960s that can be heard on many of the recordings we're all well familiar with by now. After you've selected a reverb type, you can select a preset for that reverb type. These are all good starting points for a basic reverb sound. In this example, we'll leave it at the default large plate preset. Once the preset is loaded, to make changes you can adjust any of the 12 parameter knobs all of which are labeled such as the reflection and reverb levels, diffusion, reverb time, and pre-delay. The mix knob allows you to adjust the blend of your original dry audio and the processed reverb sound. Real-time visualization can be turned on and off by clicking anywhere in the real-time visualization window. When off, the plugin name is displayed, and this will conserve CPU power. When on, the Spectral Intensity Analyzer is displayed, providing real-time visual feedback of the effect signal's amplitude over the frequency spectrum. If you like the changes that you've made to a preset, you can store them for later use. The store functionality will keep your customized presets in the User Library section of the plugin. First press the Store button, name your preset, then press Store once more, and you will have a new category called User Presets with your customized settings. We'd like to thank you again for letting Lexicon take center stage of your projects. Do you have questions or comments? Are you looking for the most recent plugin versions? Then visit us at lexiconpro.com.